Good morning. Hi, Munchka. Now he's missing. I'm listening Shit. to Morbin. Yeah. Uh, the no weekly is there. No, this is. Hi, guys. Welcome back to today's video. We are going to do some errands. Trader Joe's run. I am on a diet, a breastfeeding diet. So. It's just basically eating healthy, like hardly any carbs, no sweets, besides my coffee creamer. Um, lots of veggies, lots of protein, and some fruits, bananas, apples, grapes, mango, um, and lots of water. So I'm just like eating healthier. I know that breastfeeding, you're really not supposed to go on any crazy diet because it can um, kind of mess up your milk supply. Um, so yeah, I just want to hold myself accountable. I did this little ab workout. It was like a 20 minute ab workout yesterday on, um, uh, it was like just some YouTube thing and I could like hardly do it. I'm so out of shape, obviously. Um, but I weigh as much now as I did when I was nine months pregnant with Ben. That's how much I weigh now. Like, do you know, like, with him in me at nine months pregnant is how much I weigh now. Um, so, I'm trying to talk body positivity. Um, I'm feeling okay today. I feel good. Like, eating good. I lost five pounds in, um, from last Monday to yesterday. I didn't weigh myself today. Um, but yeah, so it's making me feel better. Um, a weight is like you know, a touchy subject that I feel like a lot of people don't want to talk about, but, like, I don't really care. Like, it is what it is. Like, I'm clearly way heavier than I was. You know what I mean? Like, it's not, like, some, like, whatever. Um, so, and talking about weight in that video when I was pregnant, I got so, so many, that's, like, the video that I got the most, like, messages about because, um, you know, other women, like, are in the same exact position that I am and it's like you know you're not alone and I'm just like I don't I'm fine talking about it you know so um anyways I'm gonna get on with my day just wanted to start today's video um, I'm editing the video that you'll see before this um, but it's gonna like take me a while so we gotta go and I'll talk to you guys soon yellow oh my god look at my little sleeping baby in the mirror <gasps> Oh gosh. Um, so I'm currently in line to get a coffee. Um, I'm all lime green today. Do you like my pants? So of course, when I'm like, okay, I'm gonna eat better, I'm on a diet, or like, you know what I mean, eating better. They come, Dunkin' Donuts comes out with the Girl Scout flavors. Like, oh my gosh. So I'm going to get these ratch grown ass nails done. I don't know what color I want to do. I like kind of want to do French, like throw it back to like 2010, but I'm not sure. Um, yeah, I haven't decided what color I'm going to do. Anyways, I'm going to get my nails done. So much crazy stuff has been happening. I've been binge watching the Aaron Hernandez documentary. So nuts. Like, especially because I'm a New England Patriot. <laughs> Hello. Um, so crazy. So anyways, so I've been watching that. Um, because, like, I I mean, we all, everyone in the United States, like, watched that all unfold. But it was just so nuts. And then last night, there was, like, this crazy Amber Alert um, of this girl in Massachusetts. My friend Samantha, hey girl, um, obsessed with you. She was like giving me the whole down low because it was from the town that she's in. And she was like, and it was just so crazy. Like this 11 year old girl was abducted. Um, and the, like so many people saw the car that she was abducted from. And then these people like videotaped it live what was happening live just like craziness it's just i'm like what is in the air like i don't know like aaron hernandez is like old news but it's just like the documentaries it's really good highly recommend i'm not finished with it yet can we help you hi can i please have a medium iced latte with the coconut caramel and almond milk Anything else? that's all please all right, thank thanks what is happening here Okay, so anyways, so 
Um, and then Nikki tutorials. We need to talk about that. Literally, guys, I had no idea. No idea whatsoever. No idea. No idea. I thought that, first of all, love Nikki. I think she's hilarious. She's insanely talented, like live, breathe, die. But I thought she was just a big girl. Like, there's big girls in the world. Like, who gives a fuck? She, I just thought she was a big girl. No, she's a boy. What? What? I was so shocked. And, like, when I saw that it said I'm coming out, I'm like, okay, is this clickbait? Like, what is this? You know, my hair looks, like, atrocious. Um, I'm like, okay, what is this? Like, is she bisexual? Like, I know she was engaged, whatever. Like, literally the last thing I thought she was going to say is she was transgender. Like, no idea. And everyone's like, oh, like, yeah, she was kind of manly. Like, the first time I ever watched her, I was like, oh, she kind of get a manly vibe. Like, no. Like, me, nothing. So, shook. Like, shook. Um, which I don't care. Like, I'm not saying, like, literally does not make one difference. Like, still love her just as much. I just had no idea. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, no idea. Hello. So, shook. Um, okay, anyways, I'm gonna get my coffee. We're gonna go get our nails done. hi yo. And, um, we'll go from there. Hello, it is a couple days later. I got my French nails done. So before I end the video, because I want to edit it and get it up because I was looking and um, I basically just did Vlogmas and then I've had one video since then. So like I need to get it together. Um, but I don't know. I feel like sometimes I can feel weird that um, I almost like use this as like not like a diary or a journal, but like just how I'm feeling. Um... But I'm just gonna be like totally honest, three months postpartum, like I'm not feeling it. I I just am so over not feeling like myself yet. And it's just like, I don't know, you truly do have that like forgetter um, after having kids. And that's what they say is like, you forget the pain of being in labor and having a baby so that you'll do it again. And like, yeah there's that but there's also just like postpartum stuff that I feel like like I'm just like trying to think to myself and I'm like what was I like you know three months three months postpartum with Michael with Benjamin like what was I like and I just like can't remember but this has just like really been really hard <laughs> and um just like you know with the extra weight and that's basically it and like I don't want to you know this extra weight that I have on is because I made this perfect, beautiful little sleeping angel and like I would not, not trade that for anything and like I don't want to get that twisted like, and like, uh, who do I follow? Jenica Parcel, I think her name is Jenica, um, has like put it really well before about how like her house is a mess but like if her house wasn't a mess like or i mean if she, it, it, her house is a mess because of she has twins and she's like but i wouldn't have to clean up this mess if i didn't have them and like i want you know like i wouldn't trade them for the world and like you know you're getting what i'm saying but um my arm's getting tired because i'm so out of shape and i'm ridiculous but um i'm just like I'm the kind of person that like I want what I want when I want it like now you know like I want instant gratification I like want to fit back into my clothes now like what the hell you know and like I keep reminding myself that like truly I and I can tell you this that I do remember is that like while I'm breastfeeding I hold on to weight um because with both of the boys, I, like, literally dropped 15 pounds, like, the month after I stopped nursing them. Um, but, like, I'm not gonna, like, stop breastfeeding her just because I want to lose weight. You know what I mean? Like, um, as a parent, we make sacrifices. And, um, you know, like, I know my body is going to look different even when I do lose weight, which is totally fine with me. Like, it is what it is. Like, I don't really care. Um... 
I just want to fit into my goddamn clothes again. Like, I'm just so annoyed. Like, my friend gave me this cute sweatshirt and I went to put it on this morning and I couldn't even, like, get it over my man shoulders. And I was just like, what is this? Like, oh my gosh. So, um, I'm just blabbering, but, like, this is where I'm at and I just feel uncomfortable in my own body and it's okay and I'm okay and like I'm I'll be fine it's just like a phase that I'm going through that I don't like and um I mean I don't think anyone would really like um so I'm gonna go visit my friend at her store I just got Benny a happy meal from McDonald's that I did not participate participate in so we're on this journey together um i will keep you further updated if you made it to this point of the video you are an og rock star like thank you so much all right guys i'm going to go thank you so much for watching subscribe if you haven't already to like follow this weight loss journey no i'm totally kidding like that is like not my thing like I don't know what my thing is. I don't know. I don't know who am I anymore. Like, I honestly don't know. Um, but like this video, help a sister out, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.